six home runs. That's third on the team. The leader for Hofstra this year, eight home runs. So again, not a ton of power from the Pride, because they've had 40 home runs as a team. That compares to North Carolina, Jay, who hit 86 home runs this season. The, you see the difference in, you know, bigger ball club, ACC ball club taking on a mid-major ball club, facing more velocities. Easier to hit home runs, the harder the ball throw. Look at that. That one got some pop in it from Brugman, and that one is gone. A two-row home run from Kevin Brugman, and the Pride taking only one nothing lead here against UNC. Said it, it's easier to hit home runs against the harder, the faster the pitch is. If you can catch it, you can use the laws of physics to get a little backspin on it, and that ball pulled down the left field line. Full extension. I think he knew the fastball was coming, and he jumped on it. But you know, Jay, you always hear about batters guessing. And when you're going up against the pitching staff in UNC, who you just talked about in a game against Virginia Tech, threw 98% fastballs. If you know that going in, why not just always guess fastballs against North Carolina and just take, it, take your luck and see what happens? Yeah. Let the breaking ball go for a strike and then you just wait at the fastball. But because they do such a good job of throwing the fastball on the inside portion of the plate to the outside portion of the plate, what happened on that home run was Carlson fell behind trying to get the outside portion of the plate to and on the count. And I believe Brunner knew, well, if he's missing outside, the next one's either going to come right down the middle or something I can pull, and he took it for a ride.